Welcome to this uh, VHF UHF channel. So that might not look super exciting, but it is a satellite that you see that line here that I'm receiving. This uh, digital hash that you hear is coming from a satellite which is called an Orbcom satellite. Uh, Orbcom satellites are, there's a lot of them, um, a lot of them are still active, they're all active pretty much in the 137 uh, megahertz range from 137 to 138 megahertz and there are several frequencies that are active. So this one is, um, I don't know which one because I would need to fire up my, um, my uh, satellite tracking software but it's one of the Arcon satellites. Uh, maybe actually I could uh, check out here um, with Orbitron um, and show you. So you see it's fading in and out uh, because of the movement in the satellite and the fact that I'm not using a uh, antenna that is directional. So it probably is this one here since it's pretty much the only one into range right now, Arbcom FM114. Uh, right just I mean in Montreal just here so it's just there to look at the uh, distance and all it's uh, right now um, it's a, a azimuth is 202 degrees which is uh, west southwest actually and it's moving south so this is probably what I'm getting um, it's the only ARBCOM and ARBCOMs like I said are all in the in that range so um, this is probably what we're getting here and you see that it's moving this is another sign that it's a satellite because satellites have what we call Doppler shifts so um, I um, if you want to decode some form of information or uh, at least the idea of a satellite you can use there's a software called Orbcom Plotter that actually will give you the ID of the satellite. So for example, it would ID itself as uh, Orbcom FM114. Uh, as for decoding anything from here, this is uh, made for satellite link uh, for phones. Uh, and this is encrypted, so there's no way of unencrypting that conversation or anything that's happening with the, with the info in here right now of the Orbcom satellites. So pretty strong signal actually uh, with, uh, when it comes to the higher peaks. So this is probably ARPCOM FM114 and uh, I'm receiving it with the K180WLA VHF magnetic loop. So this is also what I want to test today. How good it is at receiving satellites uh, at the same time on the VHF range. So um, more videos coming up today. Uh, don't worry guys. So check it out. You can, uh, you know, Check out the Orbcom FM satellites. There's a lot of them uh, up in orbit. There's almost always one up and uh, available. And often there are several. And you will see that several frequencies at the same time could be um, active. So this is kind of cool. And uh, my reception here is with the K180WLA. But you don't need a really fancy setup to actually receive them. Uh, if you have a, just a little portable scanner radio with rubber ducky go outside and um, tune when one is passing over and uh, check out uh, if you can receive it uh, outside you should actually hear it even on a small portable scanner if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching